Hey everybody, Funshine X here. Welcome back to Stoneblock 3. Uh, as promised, I fixed up these mob farms. They are both um, hostile mobs. This one is getting uh, our liquids through the slaughter factory. So those are just the same wear. Nice and clean. Everything's hidden below the ground. So it's really cool. I really like this setup. I'm not sure why they're not dying, but it's just a little bit slow. I could put some upgrades in here. Maybe we'll talk about that today. Cool. And then this one is the mob uh, crusher. Um, it gives items, and so I've moved all of our um, setup to put items in the trash can or into these um, drawers down below the, the ground. And it also gives out mob essence, which is not the same as experience. It's a little bit different. I think you can convert the two kind of directly, but we have a lot of mob essence in there. And we can even turn it off. Um, um, yeah. So when you turn off generating essence, it uses the essence to use looting on the mobs instead. Okay, so we get more items by by not generating mob essence is all I'm going to say. Sweet. Um, we've got a few legendaries we need to open. Let's see what we get. Travel anchor, a sacrificial knife, and a golden apple. Let's do these ones too. Look at all that junk. Muffling, Golden Apple, Item Collector, Chorus, Diamond Chisel, and Ethereum, Cobalt, Amethyst, and Conduit. Well, that's pretty cool. Not really. Um, let's throw all this in here. Uh, next thing I want to talk about is, actually, I need to get this stuff going. <laughs> all these, like, filled up halfway. Silly guys. Oops, I just broke my thing. Please give me my block. Thank you. Okay. Probably got sucked in here. Thank you. You can turn off though. I just, uh, Getting some more um, upgrades for my armor. Let me get a f uh, hopper. Why don't I have a hopper? Vanilla hopper, come on. And we'll just pour those right into there. And go. Okay, so that's going. Let's head down here to the industrial four going area. Uh, I added two setups for the latex um, stuff. And to each of these fluid extractors, I added a speed tier two upgrade, a efficiency tier two, and a processing tier two. So not only it's faster, it's more efficient, and then it processes twice as much. So we get tons of latex now. Thing about these old uh, machines though is they always consume power no matter what so every two seconds it's converting 500 fe that's like two it's, it's like 15 rf it's nothing really i don't care it's fine um even though we're maxed on on this it's really nothing in the grand scheme of, uh, of it i cleaned up these um so i've got a crafter right here um and that's making um different recipes so i've got like the pattern for no, that's not going to work. Um, there we go. So the pattern for an add -on, the add-ons for the range tier three, because that's the one I use the most common, and for our pity, or no, our uh, simple machine frame. Um, so, and then over here, it's also nice and clean. I've turned it off right now because I have like hundreds of plastic that I don't need. And then on the um, output, I just say push. They can all push into the middle. So I've just got an interface. It's fine, it just saves adding two exporters. I can just have one interface, um, or two importers. So let's go downstairs, and I'd like to add a pattern for the next level machine frame. And so we can go like that. And if we shift right click, we can say don't use pink slime. And we'll create that pattern. Oops, I'm gonna need an actual processor, or crafter, sorry. Uh, I don't have one. Okay, and probably need a little bit of cable that's probably in here, cool. And 
and we can just go break that. Go across like there and up here. I don't know. Oh, I probably didn't even need that. Because it's already connected to the exporter here. Okay, we're good. So you, crafter, aim this direction. Cool. And you get one of those. Nice. Uh, you've got an add-on, a speed. I put speed. I'm not sure what efficiency does. Maybe just uses less latex. I could care less about that. However, now we should be able to craft the tier two one, assuming, yeah, we don't have netherite scrap. However, netherite scrap has EMC, and we are just about to the point where we can start making anything we want that has EMC uh, for free, pretty much. <coughs> so let's go do that. Um, how do we craft scrap just for now? Because we're gonna need one um scrap is made how do i make it from you do i have to like melt this down it appears i have to melt it down first all right well let's wait because i've got one it's got amc so that's what we need let's go right into project d um i've got enough dark matter now i just turn a bunch of coal uh, into dark matter and red matter so we've got those two things and we're going for a condenser uh con conden condenser there we go uh so we need a crystal chest do we have a diamond chest yeah we do cool uh we need a Dirt chest, cool. And we need an alchemical chest. So let's get some lattice. Oh no, we're gonna have to use our one netherite scrap. Bummer, okay, it's fine. So we got one of those. <coughs> uh, obsidian chest, nope. We need... <laughs> so I have to start from the bottom. Uh, diamond, sure, then instead of a, yeah, obsidian, okay. So now we have everything we need here except for the amethyst bronze. That is going to be an alloy of um, one gem of amethyst to one ingot of copper. Okay, I, these are shards. I don't know how much a gem is. But can we Can we melt this? Yeah, that gives us one gem. Okay, cool. So let's do like eight of those and eight copper. Melt that up. And don't pour on there. Cool. Oh, and this runs fine on that. Okay. I'm actually going to take this and get our scrap. Uh, and go ahead and just melt this up too. Okay. All right, so we got uh, molten amethyst bronze. Good. Give me ingot cast. Go. And we can start melting this up. Melts super fast. All right, and we want to turn that into, we need an ingot. Okay, perfect. So as soon as it's done pouring out the purple, we should get our only two ingots of that. Okay, that doesn't produce a lot, but we only need one. <laughs> All right, so there is the one we need. Cool. Let's get our two of those. <clears throat> Excuse me. And now we should have everything need for our condenser. 
well, at least for our alchemical chest first. So a chemical chest has is a huge chest. I mean, look at that thing. However, now we should be able to go. Are you gonna? S no, you're not designed to pull things out. No, nope, give me that back. All right, alchemical chest, dirt chest, crystal chest, dark matter, red matter. Go. <laughs> okay, so it's gonna take a. Oh, that was actually super fast. I thought it was gonna take forever, but no, it wasn't. And there it is. It's beautiful. It is very beautiful. Okay, so now we just need one of these, and of course I wasted some. Oh well, don't care anymore. There. And I don't need you guys in there anymore. Just put you in there for safekeeping. Um, on my, I think my boots. Yeah, everything else. So this has got melee resistance, explosion resistance, explosion resistance. So I want melee resistance on my boots. This will only be two levels, but if I get, what, 32 more cobalt. Let's go ahead and get this melting up. I'm using my blazing blood, apparently. Oh, well. Uh, the other thing I wanted to do before we open up this condenser and see how the great thing it is, is I have a bunch of this netherite and I can actually put it on my tools uh, because I've got an upgrade here. And if you watch the mining speed, it goes from 18.7 to 23. Wow. Okay, that is a nice upgrade for that. Um, do we have our axe and does our sword have any upgrade slots? No, it's full. I think our axe does. Yep. So we could put one on there, cool. Uh, and we can actually put it on some of our armor, whichever one have upgrade slots. So you do. This move uh, gives us more durability and also some more armor toughness and knockback resist. And then on the head, uh, let's see. Yep, just gives us the same thing, more armor and more knockback resist. Okay. These ones, unfortunately, are out of uh, upgrades, but we're going to remedy that real fast. Okay, so keep you. I can get, actually, no, I need that. I need you. And give me some emerald blocks. That's emeralds. I need emerald blocks, please. Okay, so let's just go ahead and put this right here. And it's been a while since I've used this, but I'm pretty sure I say, here's the target item I want to make and make it. And it just converts all that AMC into uh, this stuff. That's probably plenty. <laughs> um, so now we've got two stacks of that. Cool. Never need to worry about that again. Um, what else do we need? Well, we need nether stars. The problem is you, with the condenser, you have to have one to get one, right? So we need to make more of that. Um, so we need to go kill the wither again. And actually, I made it so much harder. I killed him the vanilla method. Why am I killing him the vanilla method? That's so dumb. Uh, but if you look at tinted glass, uh, it's going to have a description that says prevents light, but also tough enough to withstand wither. So this is actually wither proof. Cool. Uh, we're going to need some skulls. And these have EMC, right? Oh, they do not. Okay. So they don't have EMC. Uh, but we're going to need some uh, soul sand. And even though this thing is witherproof, I'm always nervous. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and use our porter here. Uh, thanks for the comment. Somebody said I could use brackets. Nope, that's not going to work because I probably un, uh, unbound it. So this is RF tools. Probably category. Next target, previous target. So if I put these back to brackets like that. There we go. All right, so we got D, H, E, and N. So we're gonna go to the dungeon. Um, uh, 
Yeah, that sounds fine. Okay, so we've got a bunch of area here, but let's come back just where it's kind of empty a little bit. All right, this sounds like a good area right here. What am I on? Small square? Okay, that'll work. Let's make a room to fight this dude in. Okay. So I think he's okay if we just do corners like this. Sure. And we can probably do some kind of trick and like trap him so he doesn't actually do anything, but I don't remember the exact size and dimensions of where you want to spawn him and all that jazz. But if we do this, he is completely trapped, so it is really dark in there. I don't care about that. Um, and then maybe like one like that. Okay. Then we'll go ahead and I think we make it on its side in this format or else he'll go through the ceiling. Uh, just in case, <laughs> let's get out our Archangel Smite. Um, got a sword. I think we're good. Well, someone's hitting me. Hello. I don't know where you came from. That's weird. Okay. Uh, just eat a little bit. Please don't escape. I'll be so sad if he escapes. Fingers crossed, fingers crossed. Okay. Are you stuck in there? Oh, you made, oh, I forgot to do the ground. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Just don't come out, just stay in there. Okay, it did go. Perfectly smooth because we we're stupid and well, I'm stupid and forgot the ground <laughs> A little bit of uh, explosions all over the place. Oh Wow, he got kind of upset didn't he? Okay, did we get another star we did got that that's we did got, is that what I really just said? We, whatever, it works. Okay, uh, cool deal. Um, happy with that. If we ever need to kill him again, we can. Let's go to home. Awesome. We can put away those two. And we can junk some of that. Clean the inventory a little bit. Okay. And then we just come over here and say, okay, I don't want you to make scrap anymore. I want you to make nether stars. <laughs> there she goes. 22 nether stars. Actually, yeah, 23 nether stars. Beauty miss. Okay, another star adds an item slot, I believe. Uh, nope. What is it doing? It's adding soul bound. Oh, bummer. Okay, I thought I was going to add another slot of something. Let me get my book. Probably should have read the book first because I was like, oh, I can get another stars, but that's just soul bound. I mean, which is nice, but. Um, I want abilities. How do I add more slots? I'm not seeing it anywhere here. We call it like writing, right? Not wedding. Okay, if it's not an ability, maybe it is slotless. Yeah, there we go. 
Okay, so if we add two jeweled apples, we get max health. That's cool. Uh, and is this a... Uh, what is this? These are defense modifiers. Oh, okay. Let's get some uh, jeweled apples. Should have been doing that. Oh, I got a poor molten diamond on an apple. Okay. Never mind. I don't want to do that right now. Um, so instead, let's go back to the slotless stuff. Okay. So writable, draconic, harmonious, circumstance resurrected. Okay. Draconic, uh, that is the dragon head. Okay. Harmonious, a, a music disc, really? Okay. And then a head, we've got heads, and then an end crystal. And a book. Wow, these are actually really easy. A book and quill. Uh, takes ink, and there's no way to craft ink. So I've got to, I've got to make a, a pool and kill some uh, vanilla uh, guys. Okay, interesting. Um, but I think I have a billion like records, right? What are they called? Music discs. Sure. Let's do that. So that and that gives me another upgrade. Cool. I don't know if it has any, uh, negative, but it's, they're now harmonious. Cool. Uh, I got two more. Um, let's put them on that and that. Okay, with this, I want to put one of those on there. Does it do more damage now? Hey, it's finally better than the refined obsidian. Cool. You can go in there now. I don't need you. Um... So what about heads? I might have used a head on some of these already. We'll see. Yeah, it's got another upgrade. So now it's got recapacitated upgrade. Okay. All right, you guys still need a layer of netherite on you. What? Diamond or emerald to be applied. Oh, you have to apply that first. Did I apply diamond? Oh, I did apply diamond to those. But I do have two upgrades. All right, let's get a diamond. Okay. Bop, bop, bop. <laughs> I love the sound. It's like. All right. So now our armor slots are completely full. Cool. Are you done with this? Yes, you are. So now my feet still have some defense slots. I can add a few more of these. Okay. All right. So I should be 80% melee immune, 80% or well, 64, I guess. Yeah, we're just doing six levels of those, or eight levels, sorry, eight, not 10. So 64% melee immune, 64% uh, explosion immune, cool. All right, what the heck am I gonna do with all these nether stars now? <laughs> uh, I can make a beacon, I can upgrade my backpack, might have to do that. Infinity range booster, uh, that sounds great. Let's make one of those. And where is my, this guy, you are now in infinity ranged. So I can probably get rid of the other one, whatever it is. I don't remember. 
That's great. Um, so if I wanted to, I could like teleport to the end and still use this. What? What are you talking about? It's totally in range. Oh, I bet it's because my base isn't loaded. That's probably the problem. Okay, we need to do map and we need to chunk load. How do I chunk load? Not my map, it's actually this one. Have to be chunks. Nope. Claimed chunks. What's, how do you force load it? Control click, shift click, there we go. I think it's something like that. And then we'll go and claim the rest of this around here. Okay. I don't care, it's like, not like, it's I'm on my own world, there's no server here. But I force loaded all the middle stuff, maybe these ones, oops. Should be loaded too, just so I have my power generation for sure. Okay, so now let's try going back to the end. Base is loaded. There we go, we got all our stuff. Okay, that is great. Really happy about that. Go back home. All right, what else can we do with the, our infinite nether stars now? Um, this is a dimension card. Do not care about that. We're not ever going to change dimensions. Uh, can upgrade pocket storage. Don't care about the gravitational modulation unit. Oh, we got the wither builder. Don't care. No. Oh, I'm, I'm an idiot with these. I'm sorry. The, the mycelial generator. There's just generator that generate like 100 RF a tick. Um, but the different ones like take different items. So you can burn pink items. Or you can burn you know, potions. It's all like, it's just that. So they're just generators. They don't actually create random stuff. I was going the wrong direction. Um, a warding charm. That's kind of cool. Let's do that. How do I get a totem of undying? I do not remember. <laughs> Infinity wand. Don't care. Get some crystal matrixes. Um, so I should be able to get... Diamond lattices now as well, because they have EMC. And then we can got a lot of uh, other stuff here. So some big stuff like this. What does that make? An endist pearl? Soulbounder items. Yep, we already saw that. And... Oh yeah, blasting jitter. How much does this thing make? A million RF. <laughs> okay. All right, so we get an affinity nuke, a reactor. I don't know which one that one makes, but that takes a bunch of stuff. Oh, we, now that's what we can do. We can do nitro crystals now. That's what I want. Okay, let's set that up. So we need a, I think we've already got a pattern, right? Yeah, okay. So the nitrile crystal pattern should put things in here. Now the problem is, with the setup I did, um, again, this is west. Oh yeah, I need another item card. So let's get our not copy paste gadget, our card holder gadget. So we'll get another, cause this one's full, right? Oh no, I already have the things in here. Okay, that'll work. Um, so it needs block of blazing crystal and nether stars. Let me just make one of these for now. Zap, 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 lots of power. A ton of power, holy moly. <laughs> I can't even transfer that much. <clears throat> but it made it, finally, okay. Why isn't it pulling it in? 
Hmm. I don't know. Well, we have one. It's probably... Why do I have 16? This recipe makes 16 of them? Oh, it makes 16. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's why it wasn't pulling it in. It was just like bringing them in one by one. All right. Well, now with the nitro crystal, that unlocks a ton of stuff. We can get our um, uh, better magmator. Cool. Or furnator. That's what we've been using. The uh, Yeah, the furnator. Upgrade our energy cell. Upgrade our ender cells. Upgrade our cables if we want. Um, we need to make a billion of these. Well, 768 times however many singulators we need. We're one step closer to the transmutation table, guys. <laughs> but we still got to kill silverfish and do neutronium. Okay. Well, that is awesome. We unlocked nitro. We got the uh, the condenser. So I have pretty much unlimited items of whatever I currently have. Um, we upgraded our armor and our tools a little bit more. I mean, there are always more we can do. Um, but I think that was a pretty successful episode. If you guys liked it, hit that like button and subscribe to see more. I Come back next time. We are going to do something really cool with the Wither. We're actually going to mine him and make him poop out gas or fire out gas that we can then use. Uh, and then I think we're going to get into magic. A little bit of magic mods. So whether that's Botania or uh, Blood blood magic or the new one i don't know yet we'll see what do you guys want to see vote in the comments i'll see you next episode bye